Beetle and Tatum 1941. Beetle and Tatum hypothesized that enzymes determine gene expression. They experimented with the bread mold Neospora crassa. They subjected these organisms to x-rays, which acted as mutagens. Some of these organisms had genes that were mutated. They focused on the, the mutants that, which could no longer produce their own arginine. When grown on a nutritional medium without arginine, the, argin the arginine mutants did not grow, as demonstrated in the cup on the right. However, the um, non-mutants did grow, as demonstrated on the left. However, when Beetle and Tatum supplied arginine in addition to the medium, the arginine mutants did grow. They found that each mutant had a non-functioning or hindered crucial intermediate of the arginine metabolic pathway. Beetle and Tatum took the results of their experiment to support the one gene, one enzyme hypothesis. Beetle and Tatum provided backing and reinforced the one gene, one enzyme hypothesis, which was actually previously developed by Archibald Garrett in 1908. Remember, Beetle and Tatum did their experiment in 1941. Scientists later discovered that the one gene, one enzyme hypothesis was actually false. It was actually a relation between one gene and one polypeptide. This was discovered later after scientists found out the structure of protein.